Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is going to be a little haul, L I D L, little um, supermarket haul and um, an Arabian store. So let me start with the Arabian store um, because um, I ended up with two items. Um, at first, I went to Dollar Tree um, near my area, but for some weird reason, they closed. They locked the doors. All these people were coming out with bags, but they claimed they have no stock. So that's why they closed, but I think they got robbed like usual so they never do anything so um they wouldn't let me in the dollar tree so i went to the arabian store which is like on the side of the dollar tree and it's like a value store like they have all kinds of household stuff they have statues and lamps and cleaning supplies they have all kinds of nice things so anyway i picked up one of these little this is the littler one i have a big huge gallon it's like the size of a trash can and i have a few of those real big and what I like about them, it looks like a trash can. It's super clear. It's got the handles that snap on and snap off like that. You have to clean it though first. And you can store whatever you want in there. Huge. So you can store pasta. You can store like your own homemade laundry detergent if you want. Flour. Um, dried cereal goods. Beans. You can basically put whatever you want in here. Um, like I said, I have huge big ones that are the size of trash cans. And it's all filled with rice. I have more than 10,000 pounds of just rice. So that's like one of my staples um, of having in my house as a Latina. Um, you know, I'm Puerto Rican and Mexican. So I like to have um, lots of rice on hand so you never run out. So this one's like a smaller one. So I picked up this one here. It's like a smaller little, a little bit bigger than a trash can, a small trash can. But it's nice and big. Um, I'm going to use this for storing I don't know what yet. I don't know. I might do something with this. I don't know. I just picked it up anyway. Then at the Arabian store, I found this huge, big, heavy bottle. It says pine oil. And it's very thick. This is a pure pine oil. So hopefully this smells straight like real pine. Like the pine soap that I really, really love. So pine oil, it's, real hard. it's very thick and concentrated. Like super thick. So hopefully that'll work good. This was only, this big, big bottle here was like um, seven something, close to eight bucks. All right, now with LIDL, Little Store. It's a LD store, it's German, it's the same company. Anyway, let's get started with the Little Grocery Haul. I'm really excited. I found a few good things. Um, the first thing I picked up was a half a gallon of the 2% milk. This was new there. I've never seen this there before. It's a big bottle. It's from Germany. And um, this is a sweet onion sauce. So it's super big. It's a nice big, and I love onions. We love onions in our house. I have pounds, and like I have so much onions. So to have a big thing of onion sauce is so good. So you could put this on anything. You could mix it in with your food, your meatloaf. You could put it on burgers, sandwiches, whatever you want to do. I got that. Then I found these. I always buy like different kinds like this at Ross, Burlington, places like that. But these ones I don't have. Now this one here is the, um, the Let's Get Grilling Barbecue Collection Rubs. And then it has like all the flavors there. You get Mexican. See if it zooms in. Zoom in, zoom in. You get um, Memphis, like Memphis, Tennessee. Um, this one's Cajun and Southwestern. I didn't open those yet. Then this one here is another one. This one is the, um, the Butcher Shop Bacon Lovers Spice Collection. Then you get uh, bacon flavored, uh, human land salt. You got a bacon flavored salt. You got a bacon chili flavored salt. And a bacon maple flavored sugar. Oh my God. Love it. Then I got a thing of grated Parmesan and Romano cheese. Four little things of the onion powders. They're cheaper there. They're 85 cents. So I got those. I got four of those for right now because that's what I run out of quick. I could use this in one day, just one. Those that fast. Now these were ten dollars each at Little. I got this really big barbecue spice rub collection, and you get Mesquite barbecue, Cajun barbecue, Southwestern barbecue, Caribbean barbecue, Mexican barbecue, and Memphis barbecue, and they're real big. You can't go wrong with spices, and I have millions and millions of spices. Then this one here is the Bacon Lovers Collection. So you get bacon flavor, Himalayan. It's the same thing like the other one. Bacon flavored salt, bacon sugar. Okay, I got bacon basil salt, bacon rosemary salt, and a bacon chili salt. So it looks so good. Oh my God. Then I picked up like, um, I think eight boxes of the Four Cheese Deluxe. 
mac and cheese. These are really good. It's light and creamy. has a good taste to it. And they're cheap. They're like $1.40 over there. I got some submarine, um, you know, sub oil. My son likes them with his sandwiches. Um, I got two things right here of cinnamon applesauce. Got a whole bunch of cheeses, pepper jack cheeses and slices. So I got two packs of those. One queso freco, which is Mexican cheese. Got a big thing of chicken breast lunch meat. And then I got a forest ham lunch meat. I got some breakfast sausage. Well, I got two breakfast sausages and then one Italian sausages. Two big boxes of sparkling waters. I got the passion fruit. And then this one here is, um, I think it's, yeah, it's black raspberry. And I got this huge big thing of the Pure Life 24 pack of waters. And then I picked up um, these, but we drank them as the black raspberry LIDL brand, like a sparkling type of water really good and that's it guys that's all I picked up from the Arabian store and the LIDL I'm really excited to find um, what to do with this onion sauce and of course I love my seasonings so anyway that's it guys that's all I bought at LIDL and the Arabian store thanks for watching this quick um, grocery little haul and I will talk to you guys later let me know if you ever tried any of these things and what you think about them Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Have a good day. Bye.